Hey friends, my name is Jen and I love cookies. So this week is Thanksgiving and so I decided that the whole week I'm going to rate holiday appropriate cookies. Um, I've got a pumpkin cookie planned, an apple pie cookie, and today I'm going to kick things off with this cranberry white chocolate cookie from Not As Famous Cookies. I forgot to grab their thing. Here it is. Not As Famous Cookie Co. They are a food truck. I want to say they're based in Atlanta. But I didn't look and it doesn't say on here, so I'm not 100% certain. Um, the instruction card said that if I want to, I can warm them up in the oven. But I chose these ones specifically because I thought they were the only ones I wouldn't have to warm up in an oven. So I'm not going to do it. Um, at least not right now. Maybe I'll stick them in the microwave. We'll see. Anyway... <laughs> Um, so Not As Famous Cookie Co. food truck, I think somewhere in Atlanta. Cranberry white chocolate cookie. I like that it has a very rustic shape. I think that's what you're supposed to say when it's not like round. Um, I see some cranberries and some white chocolate in there. So yes, they were not lying about the type of cookie. I can see some in the bottom as well. It's a little bit wider than I expected. I feel like a lot of cookies are more like tan colored and this one's pretty white. So it's probably standard sugar, blah, 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 blah. standard sugar cookie dough with uh, just white chocolate and cranberries mixed in. But let's find out. There's a lot going on here. I'm gonna have to take another bite to be able to talk about it. I'm gonna say the cookie as a whole is crumbly in texture. Um, I'm sure if I stuck it in the oven like I was supposed to for three to five minutes at 350 degrees, it would be nice and gooey, but it didn't do that. <laughs> so the whole thing is crumbly, but I've decided I actually like crumbly cookies. This one had a really interesting flavor journey. Like there were multiple points in this cookie where I was like, that's a flavor, that's a flavor, that's a flavor. So let me take another bite and see if I can accurately take you on this journey. Okay, so it's like sugar cookie, and then that one had white chocolate in it, so that was next. Then it goes back to sugar cookie. I think there might be a lot of vanilla in the sugar cookie. I think that's what I'm tasting at the end. Um, it like gets sweeter toward the latter half of chewing it, whereas the first half is not as sweet. It's hard, <laughs> it's a very subtle flavor difference and like I'm noticing it, but I don't know how to put it into words. You have to taste it, I guess. I think that was my first bite with a cranberry in it. The cranberry is very sweet. Like the rest of the cookie is normal sugar cookie sweet, which I would still say is on the sweeter end as far as cookie goes, cookies go. But when you get a cranberry, it's like, whoo, that was a moment with a whole lot of sugar there. All right, you know what? It did get a little gooier toward the center, 
um, as I got away from the edges. But I've eaten roughly half of it. I am gonna go stick it in the microwave, let's say 15 seconds, and see how I feel about it once it's been microwaved, because I feel bad for ignoring the oven instructions. So I'll be right back. Okay, so I actually did 10 seconds because I realized I ate half the cookie, so I needed to reduce the microwave time. Um, the other thing is I think that this half of the cookie has more cranberries and white chocolate chips, so that may make a difference as well. Mm-hmm. Should have done that from the beginning. This is now perfect texture. Nice and crumbly on the outside. Very gooey and warm and comforting on the inside. I didn't say there was any orange in here, but I am tasting a hint of citrus. Yeah. My brain just like farted and I thought I said citrus wrong. That's correct. Um, <laughs> I'm definitely getting a hint of citrus and it's pretty normal for cranberry flavored desserts to also have orange in them. Not a huge fan of that personally. Um, I don't know why I like orange juice, but I just don't like orange flavored desserts. Um, so I think I'm getting that and not loving it, and I still think that cranberries are really sweet, but definitely improved by heating it up, so I should have done that in the beginning. Sorry, not as famous cookie co. Okay, so before I heated it up, I think the edges were just a little bit too crunchy for me, but once I stuck it in the microwave, it was absolutely the perfect texture. Um, Crumbly on the outside, gooey on the inside. My now favorite type of cookie, big fan. Um, I'm realizing now as I'm talking, there was an aftertaste in my mouth that I was like, what is this? It's macadamia nuts. There are also macadamia nuts in these cookies. Um, to be honest, I think they could have done without. I do like white chocolate macadamia nut cookies, but I feel like because these ones have the cranberries, they didn't really need them, and they just added like a confusing taste that was unnecessary. I also don't think there were actually that many of them in there, but maybe there were and I just didn't realize it. Um, I think that the dough itself was a little bit boring. Um, even though I have that hint of potentially citrus in there, I just felt like it needed more flavor in the dough itself. Or if it wasn't going to have that, it needed more um, white chocolate chips and cranberries mixed in. But also... I'm not the type of person that's like, oh, that's too sweet. I don't like it, obviously. <laughs> um, but I do have specific foods that I'm used to lower sugar versions. So I eat a lot of craisins, but I eat the ones that have reduced sugar. And so these craisins tasted just like so, so sweet to me. Um, and I think it was too much sugar in this particular case. So a lot of that is my personal taste, but a lot of it isn't. It was good. Um, I will happily eat the other five, but I don't know that I would order them again. So I think what I'm going to do is go ahead and give these a 5.6, which I will put there. All right, so that was the white chocolate macadamia nut cranberry cookie from Not As Famous Cookie Co. Um, here's the picture of their cookies. They have the two cookies that I ordered for them, so I have another one that's apple pie. Are there like seasonal? November or fall flavors, but they have a ton of other cookies that they have all of the time. So lots of options. Um, if you like watching me talk about cookies, please like, comment, and or subscribe below. Thank you for watching. Have a fantastic day and eat more cookies.